Welcome to Seoul. My name is Eric Rosen and I'm a traveling food writer from Los Angeles. I've come to the Korean capital for a couple days to explore what the city has to offer. When you think of Seoul, you might think of K-pop, Gangnam style, and in the popular imagination, the city is often depicted as a high-tech, futuristic metropolis that's a vision of what's to come. But only recently has Seoul become an exciting hub of design and fashion. We're in Chongdandong, which is the luxury shopping district of Seoul. And it's also home to 10 Corso Como. So here is our main floor, mm -hmm. which is also designed by Chris Ruth. We also introduced Korean designer to our Korean customers. What's so special about the bookstore here mm -hmm. in Corso Como? For slow shopping, it's really important to have a book because you can just read and you know relax. They say that culture is food and food is culture. So I thought there'd be no better way to discover Seoul than through its cuisine. I visit some of the city's top restaurants and get an inside look into what's cooking in the minds of Korea's most innovative chefs. Looking for a place to eat in Seoul can be overwhelming, but if there was one restaurant I knew I had to try, it was Chef Edward Kwan's Lab 24. Chef Edward Kwan is basically Korea's first celebrity chef. He's worked in restaurants all over the world, including the United Arab Emirates, Europe, and North America, and he's brought all those influences to bear on the contemporary French cuisine that he cooks here at Lab 24, and through which he's aiming to change the way Koreans eat. Lab 24 is actually uh, meaning beyond as a laboratory 24 hours. So chefs thinking about the food 24 hours, chef working with ingredient 24 hours. A lot of people, they thought this is real like laboratory, but actually we are restaurant. I've got the butter poached lobster, which comes in a kefir lime, beurre blanc with ocetra caviar. While I considered staying at one of Seoul's major chain hotels, instead I decided to try one of the boutique hotels that is becoming increasingly popular with global travelers. To be honest, we have uh, 90 rooms, in, even in one branch, and also that is the all different rooms, so every customer has a, have a different niche. 